So let's do a mole fraction problem. This one says a uh, mixture of gases contains 4.46 moles of neon, 0.74 moles of argon, and 2.15 moles of xenon. Find the mole fraction for each of these uh, gases. So remember mole fraction, capital X. Okay, so the mole fraction of a gas is going to be the number of moles of that gas divided by the number of moles total. So we got to figure out, well, what's the total number of moles? So let's do that. So 4.46 plus 0.74 plus 2.1, 7.35 total number of moles. Okay, is everybody okay with doing that part? So, how do we figure out, well, what's the mole fraction of neon? What do we put on top? 4.46 moles divided by 7.35 moles. Okay. The mole fraction of argon. What's going to be on top? 0 0.74 moles. And on the bottom? 7.35 moles, right? And the mole fraction of uh, xenon, what's that going to be? 2.15 moles divided by 7.35 moles. Watch. Moles cancel in each one of these. Mole fraction is unitless. So 4.46 divided by 7.35. Six zero seven, all right. Zero point six zero seven. It's the mole fraction for neon. Okay. Point seven four divided by uh, seven point three five. Zero point one zero. The mole fraction for argon. Only two sig figs on that one, right? And 2.15 divided by 7.35 is going to be 0 0.293. Okay, so the mole fraction for xenon is 0 0.293. Uh, let's figure out the partial pressure for just one of these. What do you say? Okay. So how will we do that? Um, P B equals N R T. Oh, but we didn't write down the rest of the problem. Okay, sorry, we can we just can't kill this one. I didn't give you the rest of the problem today.